Our new account management sports a modern, easy-to-use, intuitive interface characterized by responsive design across all platforms. The features include a simplified menu that gives users quick and easy access to all account management functions, quick access to all account and user settings from two simple screens, a homepage that provides a consolidated view of balances and positions, statements, trade confirmation, reports and flex queries available from a single screen, Pending items, messages, and corporate actions accessible from any screen in account management. Clients with multiple accounts can take advantage of our new intuitive account selector that is specifically designed to make it easier to find and choose linked and partitioned accounts. In this video, we'll provide you with a brief tour of account management and explain some of its key functionalities. Throughout the new AM page, look out for the question mark symbol. Click these to learn more about the definitions displayed or to access an underlying cheat sheet to provide additional help. And wherever you see these blue gear symbols, it means that you can configure something. The home page is easily found from the control panel on the left. Notice the home button at the top. Here, you will be able to quickly see a summary of your account net asset value and margin requirements. Portfolios are displayed in the pie charts according to long and short positions by asset classes. While below, you can expand each asset class to display individual holdings. When you expand an asset class to the right of any line, the positions are displayed in alpha order, but you can resort by clicking on the sortable column headers. Notice how the top positions are broken out by long and short pie charts at the top of the page. Click the Home button to return. Click the plus sign next to the Reports menu. That will reveal the group of statements that you will need to access to create and download standard and configurable reports. Let's look at each. The Portfolio Analyst lets you analyze the performance of your IB account, view balances, returns, positions and trades in external financial institutions accounts. Users may analyze portfolio or position performance on daily, monthly or quarterly time periods using industry standard risk measures. Performance can be measured using time-weighted or money-weighted returns. Portfolio Analyst provides performance attribution so that clients may see how asset allocation or security selection affected portfolio performance in comparison to the S&P 500 index. If you want to manage external accounts, click this button to view your bank accounts, credit card information, and so on. The Statements menu allows clients to access default, customized, or third-party statements. Use the drop-down selection menus to build mark-to-market -market summaries, model performance, activity, realized P&L statements, and trade confirmations. These reports are deliverable in various formats. To the right of the page, you will see a custom statements area where you can build and save your own requests. Below is the statements delivery area. Use the configure wrench to set your activity statement and daily trade report notification. These can be enabled by email, as attachments to an email, or sent to your account management center. They can also be disabled. Users may build, save, and run trade confirmation flex queries from this area, and can also schedule delivery using the configuration wrench to the right of the screen. Use the Other Reports tab to select from a series of risk reports or transaction cost analysis. This enables you to review trade fill prices and market conditions from the time your order was entered to when it was filled. You can locate and download various available tax forms for the last five years under the Tax Report menu. Select the desired report and required year and choose the format to download. Use the Help icon to access a link to complete descriptions of tax forms, reports and important tax-related issues. You will also see the Tax Optimizer window to the right of the page. This allows clients to select a day and launch the tool to help minimize tax obligations should you wish to close out specific positions that would create a tax event. Use the Cost Basis Configuration Design to specify cost basis for positions transferred into your account using ACATS and other transfer methods. Cost Basis is the original value of an asset and is generally used to determine the capital gain from a sale of securities. In the Transfer section, users can review history, transfer funds and positions, and review saved information. 
On the transaction history page, use the slider to govern the period you want to view, search for a specific transaction, or list all transactions by type, method, or status. The transactions for the search period display on the page to the right. The results can be exported to Excel using the export icon in the upper right. Expand the settings icon to display additional fields to your search and exported results. Use the transfer funds page to make deposits or withdrawals to or from your account. The display shows cash balance and funds available for withdrawal, assuming margin loan. You can also see the status of funds deposited to your account. Using the transaction type drop down menu, select deposit or withdrawal and follow through the additional drop down boxes to make further selections. From the transfer positions menu on the left, the display will allow users to choose inbound or outbound position transfers. When you select inbound, complete the broker information appearing on screen and determine whether to save your completed form for later use. Click continue. For outbound transfers, select from the two methods and proceed to the transaction information at the bottom of the page. Use the add asset button for each additional position you wish to select. Click continue at the bottom right of the page when you have completed the forms. You can retain funding information and keep it available from the Saved Information menu on request. You can also edit from this page. Under the Settings menu, you'll be able to locate Account and User Settings. Account settings display your profile, financial information and trading permissions. Edit your financial information by using the Configure wheel. Here you can record your income, investment experience and trading objectives. Under the configuration menu to the right, you can select your account type, base currency, commission pricing structure, create and reset a paper trading account, and configure a host of IB FYIs. Use the configuration settings in the reporting section to the lower right to enable or disable flex web services and or third party services. Click on the user's configuration wheel and add people whom you want to grant login or trading access to your account. You can assign and configure user roles in the area below. Here, you can set asset classes and regional trading permissions. Use the configuration wheel to make changes. Upon opening the configuration section, users can also sign up for IB's Stock Yield Enhancement Program in which IB automates the lending of certain securities on behalf of the client. Use the menu below to make additional regional or product specific changes to your account. When you have made your selections, use the continue button to the bottom right of the screen to submit your request to IB. Typically, you should be able to trade newly requested products after 24 hours. User settings is where all of your personal information is stored, telling us how you want to receive communication from IB and how you can access certain IB features. You can change your password from this page and create a voting subscription, enabling you to access the Features Poll, Traders Chat, and Traders University Learning Center on the IB website. Configure the items in the communications area to add or change email addresses, and to inform us where to send alert notifications. Configure security restrictions, including IP addresses from the area below. In the Trading Platform panel, users may turn on and off market data subscriptions, as well as add and cancel subscriptions to research providers. If you are subscribed to a research provider, details are shown in the configuration area. Use the blue wheel to access the entire list of research available and add to your current subscriptions. From the reporting area, use the configuration wheels to access delivery settings and formats for portfolio analyst and statements. Choose the email or FTP delivery, the periodicity and level of detail for your reports and click the continue button when ready to confirm your settings. Use the investors marketplace menu to review the list of available advisors or brokers from the marketplace. Use the filters above the list to change the sort for the display. The final menu on the navigation panel to the left is for support. In this area, you can access the message center, review FX trades within a 15 minute window in your account, submit trade cancellation requests, create tax correction forms and access the live IB chat facility. When you log into account management, you will see an alert bell icon next to the IB logo in the upper left. The alert icon will display the number of notifications 
for corporate actions, pending items, or IB messages for you to easily access. Use the language selector to the upper right of the screen to change the language display. Click the Interactive Brokers logo to return to the home page. If you have any suggestions regarding account management, you may submit them via the Feedback button to the lower right of the screen. The new account management page for your account is easy to navigate. Don't forget to use the Help icons for additional guidance if you can't immediately find what you're looking for. And remember to use the many configuration icons to set the account management area to precisely how you'd like it. Thanks for watching.